Lush greenery and cultivated fields are standout qualities of Umako, one of the 20 communities in our local government area of Enugu State. The breathtaking scenery seems to stretch forever, exposing the opportunities in agriculture. But for some, green is not their color of choice when it comes to achieving a breakthrough. They go for brown in the form of stones. Stone crushing is the second largest employer of labor in the community and its environment. And these elderly men and women testify to how lucrative it is, the only reason they brave the health hazards that come with it. There are some that are softer than each other, and there are some that are very hard. There are some that if you discover it, you cannot even break it to crack it to these sizes. Many, like Francis, are also prone to injuries as he recounts his experience. He and other crushers are seeking government support in providing them with modern equipment and protective gears. I sustained this injury during the crushing process. A particular stone suddenly shattered. It went up in the air and landed on my hand. I have taken medication, but it's not enough to deter me. In some other places, we have heard stories of those who lost their lives, especially during excavations process. Although this venture contributes greatly to the local economy, health and environmental experts are worried about the overall impact. You have the silicosis from inhaling dust from the stones, crystalline dust, actually. Then these diseases, or rather these dust, will affect the uh, area of the lung that is in charge of gas exchange. The more they do that, they are reducing the value of the land in terms of land use for agriculture and other, other things. So they are, these are immediate impacts. As the crushers count their gains in the face of danger to their health, the authorities might do well to come up with a plan to mitigate the discomfort and at the same time provide the tools to develop the trade and protect the people. Nkiruka Ajogu, Channels Television News.